Let's talk about Reaper. In this series of short videos, I'm going to show you step by step how you can connect to and control Reaper directly from your Midas HD console. So you can connect your console to your computer either via Ethernet or Cobalt. Starting with Ethernet, once the Ethernet connection is made between the console and the computer, in the network preferences you can go ahead and select the device. Open the configuration, set the IP to manual and enter the following details. The IP address should be 192.168.10.100 and the subnet mask should be 255.255.255.0. There's a second stage for this in the console's network preferences. We need to configure a wired network connection to a similar IP address to that of the computer. So let's go for 192.168.10.150. The same subnet mask, 255.255.255.0. And then finally, you can set the gateway to the same IP address as the computer, so 192.168.10.100. Now the console is going to show you now that you have limited or local connectivity only. That's fine in this case because we're not trying to configure an internet connection. Once you've done that, the device on your computer is going to go green and show up as connected. Now the Cobalt connection requires one less step, but it has got some differences in its IP configuration, so let's take a look at that as well. The IP should be 192.168.20.100 and the subnet mask 255.255.0.0. With those details entered correctly, you'll see the Cobalt will show up as connected in the same way as your Ethernet device did. And that's it. Don't forget, you can also find full written instructions for the connection process at cloud.midasconsoles.com.